Hey guys! Merry Christmas! Merry, 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 Merry Christmas! What's going on? It's your girl Anita Rivers of Classic Royalty. Welcome back to my channel and it's Christmas! Yay! I'm super excited. As you guys can see, I'm in the Christmas spirit. Ugh, I'm in a Christmas spirit. Got my Christmas hat on. Got my Christmas onesie. I even got a Christmas pillow from Walmart. I'm like so in the Christmas spirit. If you guys see behind me, there's my Christmas tree with all my gifts. I'm super excited. And I want to do a video just for the holidays, something very simple. You know, a lot of you guys may not be here in New York City, but I know a lot of you guys have small apartments because you are up and coming fashion designers. And there are many different ways that how you can do some nice decor in your small apartment, your studio, your one bedroom apartment. And that's what this video is gonna be about. I wanna show you guys how you can still be in the Christmas spirit if you have a small space. Because even though I do live in New York City, my apartment is kind of big for New York City, but I know a lot of you guys' spaces may be a little bit smaller. Like I said, a studio or a one bedroom. If you guys have roommates, I'm gonna show you guys how you can still uh, make your home uh, fun, festive, uh, creative with using very simple decor like from Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, your regular 99 cent store and just ways on how you can put things on the wall so it can read expensive and still um, not break your pockets. First I want to go ahead and start with this pillow. I got this pillow. You guys can see it's like snow in the background, the back is red. I got this from Walmart and I got another pillow to match. It was two pillows for $10 from Walmart. And with this pillow, I can just place it right here on my couch, just like that. And already it says Christmas and it yells out Christmas. So this is great, right? Right? I'm gonna pick you guys up. I'm gonna show you around my house so I can show you guys the decor that I'm working with. Let's go. All right, guys. I actually want to take you around the house. I want to just show you what this is looking like because this is my mirror. And we're gonna go ahead and go this way. So I have these in my house as decor, but to make it more Christmas, I just added some Christmas ornaments on here. And I also have some candy canes hanging. So from afar, this is what it looks like. See, right there and right there. And I just added some decor. If I go to the right, there's my mini Christmas tree. There's no need for a big Christmas tree. As you guys can see, my Christmas tree is on top of my dining table and my presents are around. This is another simple way you guys can celebrate Christmas and decor if you don't have the space because I don't have the space and I don't want a real Christmas tree. So I got me maybe like a, a three foot Christmas tree with lights. The lights came with it. The star came with it. It was thick. It was... The Christmas tree was $20 and as you guys can see I have the presents around the Christmas tree and if I had more there will be more presents. Oop, there's one right there. There will be more presents on the floor. If I go this way you see I just added some tassel on the wall to make it more decorative to have some color in the house and if we scroll this way there are some Christmas decor on the wall up there. There's my liquor for New Year's and then on top let me cover this light and then on top there are just merry christmas things on the wall to make them more festive and then right here there are also some more things hanging from my ceiling it's very simple and if you go down here's the other pillow that i was talking about because this pillow just adds a little bit more redness to the room like the redness and the plaid goes with the redness and the green and also the redness and plaid goes with this set let me turn the light this way. So yeah. If I bring this up a little bit, the pillow goes with my table set, I guess. And then here I have my juice. That's not wine, guys. That's juice. And then I have some candles. And I bought this basket from Family Dollar. And I just added some balls on the inside with a 99 cent flower. Like there's many different ways of doing it, guys. Let me turn the light a little bit so you guys can see. Like you don't have to over-exaggerate the decor. It's very simple. 
And then here on my wall, I just added, you know, simple dollar stockings. I added a green one and a red one. And then I have some of my family members that sent me cards. I just taped those to the wall. Very simple. And it looks very nice. When people come through the door, this is exactly what they see. It's very simple. You don't need too much. Here's something else I added to in the back of my chairs. I have these big, big Santa hats and they just flop over. So that also gives the home some, you know, Christmas spirit feel. And that's really it. So I have my Christmas tree, my presents. I have my balls on the edge of my uh, trees here, I guess. I have things there on the wall, things on this side, stuff up there, and stuff up there. Not to mention I have my pillow, the pillow. And I have my nice little, you know, Christmas inspired table. And that's really all you guys need. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys how simple it is to, um, just wanted to show you guys how simple it is to decorate your house or your apartment or your studio if it's not that big. My apartment is not that big, but I found ways of making it very pretty. I also have this here. Um, if the Christmas tree wasn't there, this will be where the Christmas tree is. I got this um, candle holder from Burlington. It was $6.99 and just a regular 99 cent, um, I forget what you call pine cones? Yeah, I got these pine cones and they do smell, but as you guys can see, this is how I have it decorated, so. Simple. So yeah, that's about trying to get comfortable. <laughs> but anyway, that's about it, guys. I just wanted to show you guys my home for the holidays. I'm home by myself. You know, I'm not drinking any wine. I'm drinking juice, and I'm just trying to keep myself in the Christmas in the Christmas spirit as much as possible. Um, I know a lot of people out there. This is a tough season you know people are losing jobs people are losing you know family members and things aren't going the way you want them to go and that can make Christmas time very hard for you know teenagers young adults adults um, even pets because there's pets out there who are just living on the street who don't have no food who don't have no pet owner and it's very difficult for them as well so maybe if you don't have ten dollars if you don't have twenty dollars maybe you have five dollars Go to the 99 cent store, get you maybe two Christmas signs, put one on your door and one in the living room, and that can definitely make a difference. Walking through that door after a long day of whatever you guys are doing and just seeing Merry Christmas on your door or on your wall can definitely change your spirit, can change your hope, can change your faith. And that happened to me. Put everything up in one day and coming home to this tree in the background with all these lights, it just does something to your soul. It does something to me. Like... I don't know, I love coming home and seeing my decor all over the house because it's Christmas, you know? It's Christmas and it's supposed to make you happy. Seeing red and green and, and gold and, and Christmas lights and people singing Christmas carols and, you know, eggnog and juice and family members, it's supposed to make you happy. And, you know, if you're not happy, try your best. Go spend time with friends. Go spend time with co-workers. Um, if someone invites you over for dinner, go. Even if you're not interested, go. You never know what can happen just going from that one event. So, yeah. This is going to be a short video. It's a very short video. I just felt like uh, coming to you guys tonight, giving you a video, giving you a little tour. And again, if you haven't subscribed, uh, please do so. Leave your comments below in the comments. There's a whole list of information in the description about myself, my sewing group, everything else. And again, if you celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas. If you don't, Happy Holidays. And that's about it. And I'll see you guys next time. Merry Christmas, guys.